فلقد يسرنا القرآن للذكر فهل من مدكر السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته إن شاء الله we continue with the rest of the verses of Surah Safat we start from verse number 83 of Surah Safat أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم وإن من شيئته لإبراهيم إذ جاء ربه بقلب سليم إذ قال لأبيه وقومه ماذا تعبدون أيفكا آلهة دون الله تريدون فما ظنكم برب العالمين فنظر نظرة في النجوم فقال إني سقيم فتولوا أنه مدبرين and verily of his way surely was Ibrahim alayhi salam that is the way of Nuh alayhi salam about which we discussed last evening. When he came to his Lord with a sound heart, when he said to his father, that is Ibrahim al Islam said to his father, Bakhomi and to his people, Maza Tabudun, what is it you are worshipping? Aifkan Aliatan, is it false gods besides Allah you desire? Then what do you think about the Lord of the worlds? Panazara Nazratan fin Nujum. Then he cast a glance at the stars. Then he said, Inni Sakim, verily I am sick. Fatawallahu anhu mudbirin. Then they went away from him, showing their backs or departing. Or Beshak Uske Tarikh Par Tha Zarur Ibrahim al Islam. Jab Aya Uske Rabke Ha Khalbe Salim Kulekar. جب ابراہیم علیہ السلام نے کہا اپنے باپ سے اور اس کی خوم سے کس چیز کی تم عبادت کر رہے ہو کیا جھوٹے معبودوں کی اللہ کے علاوہ تم چاہتے ہو پھر تمہارا کیا خیال ہے رب العالمی کے بارے میں پھر اس نے ایک نگاہ دوڑائی ستاروں کی طرف پھر اس نے کہا بے شک میں بیمار ہوں پھر وہ پھر گئے اس سے پیٹ دکھاتے ہو some people have commented saying that Ibrahim and Islam spoke a lie I don't think it is a lie at all sick does not necessarily mean only physically sick you can even be mentally sick and if you take it from the context then it looks like Mohi is mentally sick that means fed up of these sorrows so sick does not necessarily mean only physical sickness it can even be a mental sickness and Ibrahim al Islam has been totally frustrated with these people. He said, I'm sick. That means I'm fed up of you. I am sick. That means I'm fed up of you. This is also a kind of way of being a person. A person is afraid of his body. He said, 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 فَعَلَىٰ تَعْبُدُونَ مَا تَنْحِتُونَ وَاللَّهُ خَلَقَكُمْ وَمَا تَعْمَلُونَ فَرَاغَ إِلَىٰ آلِحَتِهِمْ Then he turned towards their gods. That is those statues and idols which they had made. Then he turned towards their god. Then he said, أَلَىٰ تَعْكُلُونَ Do not you eat? مَا لَكُمْ لَا تَنْتِخُونَ What is the matter with you? Not you speak? Then he turned upon them. زَرْبَمْ بِالْيَمِن Striking with his right hand. فَأَخْبَلُوا إِلَيْهِ عَزِفُونَ Then they turned towards him rushing. Ibrahim al Islam asked, أَتَعْبُدُونَ مَا تَنْهِتُونَ وَاللَّهُ خَلَقَكُمْ وَمَا تَعْمَلُونَ Do you worship what you carve out while Allah created you and what you make? پھر وہ متوجہ ہوا ان کے خداوں کی طرف پھر پوچھا کیا نہیں تم کھاتے ہیں? کیا ہو گیا تمہیں نہیں تم بات بھی کر سکتے پھر وہ پلٹا ان کی طرف ضرب لگاتے ہوئے اپنے دائیں ہاتھ سے پھر وہ لوٹے اس کی طرف دوڑتے ہوئے ابراہیم علیہ السلام نے پوچھا کیا تم عبادت کرتے ہو جس کو تم اپنے ہاتھوں سے تراشتے ہو حالانکہ اللہ نے پیدا کیا تمہیں اور جو کچھ تم بناتے ہو خالو ابن لہو بنیانن فالخو ہو فی الجہیم فَعَرَادُ بِهِ قَيْدًا فَجَعَلْنَاهُمُ الْأَسْفَلِينَ 
وخالا انی زاہب الا ربی سیاح دین دے سیڈ بلڈ فار ہم اسٹرکچر دین کاسٹ ہم ان دا بلیزنگ فائر Then they intended against him a plot. But we made them the lowest. Ibrahim al-Islam said, Inni zahibun ila rabbi sayahdeen. Verily, I am going away towards my Lord. Soon he will guide me. Unho ne kaha, Tamir karo uske liye ek imarat. Phir pheng do usko badhti hui aag mein. پھر انہوں نے ارادہ کیا اس کے خلاف ایک چال پھر ہم نے بنا دیا ان کو نیچوں میں سے نیچ اور ابراہیم علیہ السلام نے کہا بے شک میں چلا جا رہا ہوں میرے رب کی طرف انخری وہ میری رہنمائی کرے گا تو ابراہیم علیہ السلام فیل that it was a sheer waste of time behind these people who have been so stubborn and showing their arrogance and not prepared to accept the truth in spite of it being conveyed to them and clear terms and they saw it with their own eyes how Allah saved them from the fire even that could not drive sense into their heads so Ibrahim alayhi salam ne socha ke abhi in ke piche padna goya ke wakht ko zaya karna yehi log to nahi hai jis ko joh hai din pounchaya jaya jaya kahi Allah ki makhluk aur bhi hai aur kahi aur log bhi hai jis ke paas yeh din pounchaya jaya jaya sakta to Ibrahim alayhi salam said instead of wasting time behind these people it is better to go and address and convey the message to other people who are living in different parts of the cities in and around Iraq where he was born. So he said, I'm going away to my Lord. He will guide me. Rabbi habli minas salihin fabashshad nahu bi ghulamin halim falama balaga maahu saaya khala ya bunaya inni ara fil manami anni azbahu ka fanzur maza tara قَالَ يَا عَبَتِ فَالْمَاتُ عُمَرْ سَتَجِدُونِ إِنشَاءَ اللَّهُ مِنَ الصَّابِدِينَ My Lord bestowed to me in bracket a son among the righteous. Then we gave him glad tidings of a son forbearing. Then when he reached with him the age of running, Ibrahim al Islam said, O my son, Verily, I have seen in my dream that I am slaughtering you. Fanzur maza tara. Then give me your opinion. So see what you see means give me your opinion. Ismail al-Islam said, Ya abatif al-matumar. Oh my father, do what you have been commanded. Soon you will find me if wishes Allah to be among the patient ones. میرے رب عطا کر مجھے یعنی ایک لڑکا سالحین میں سے پھر ہم نے اس کو خوشخبری دی ایک بردبال لڑکے کی پھر جب وہ پہنچا اس کے ساتھ دوڑ دوب کرنے کی عمر ابراہیم علیہ السلام نے کہا اے میرے بیٹے بے شک میں نے دیکھا ہے خواب میں کہ میں تجھے زبا کر رہا ہوں بس بول تیری کیا رائے ہے اسماعیل علیہ السلام نے کہا اے میرے ابا جان تم کر گزرو جس کا تمہیں حکم دیا گیا ہے انخریب تم مجھے پاؤ گے اگر اللہ چاہے تو صبر کرنے والوں میں سے سو ابراہیم علیہ السلام سو ان ایس ڈریم خواب میں انہوں نے دیکھا کہ اپنے لخت جگر کو یعنی اسماعیل علیہ السلام کو زباہ کرنے اور انبیاء اکرام کے خواب جو ہے ہمارے جیسے خواب نہیں ہوتے ہیں وہ بھی ایک وحی کا ایک ذریعہ ہوتے ہیں unlike us the prophets when they see some dream it is the form of a وحی to them and Ibrahim and Islam knew very well that it is the order of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so he expressed this matter before Ismail al Islam was just a small boy just growing. And see the answer of Ismail al Islam. 
अनबिलीवेबल सोच भी नहीं जा सकता <coughs> इतना छोटा मासूम बच्चे को जब उनकी उसकी राय पूछी जाती है तो वो कितना बेहतरीन जवाब देता है आफ्टरऑल ही इज द सन ऑफ एन एलिस्ट्रेस फादर लाइक इब्राहिम अलैहिस्सलाम और औलाद में बच्चों के और औलाद के अंदर वालदे के सिफात बहुत पाए जाते हैं physically emotionally and the complete mental setup of the parents do are found even in children and here you find ismail al islam emulating the excellent qualities of ibrahim al islam <clears throat> and without any hesitation he says go ahead do what you have been commanded as far as i am concerned i am prepared to cooperate with you in every way and i will remain steadfast in what i have said main is baat par sabit qadam rahunga aur pura taawun tumse karne ko main taiyar hu lamma aslama wa tallahu lil jabin wa nadaynahu ay ya ibrahim qad saddaqta ar ru'ya inna kazalika nazil muhsinin ان هذا لهو البلاء المبين وفديناه بذبح عظيم وتركنا عليه في الاخرين سلام على ابراهيم كذلك نجزي المؤمنين انه من عبادنا المؤمنين then when they both submitted and he laid and he laid him on his forehead that is ibrahim al islam laid ismail salam on his forehead and we called out to him wana de nahu and we called out to him that o oh, ibrahim certainly you have proved true or you have fulfilled your dream verily we thus recompense the good doers verily this surely was a trial manifest and we ransomed him with a sacrifice great wa tarakna alayhi fil akhirin and we left upon him that is a good name in the later generations peace be upon ibrahim alayhi salam thus we recompense the good doers verily he was from our slaves believers <clears throat> फिर जब दोनों ने सर तस्लीम खम कर दिया और इब्राहिम इस्लाम ने लिटा दिया उसको पिशानी के बल और हमने निदा दी उसको कि ए इब्राहिम यकीनन तूने सच कर दिखाया तेरा खब बेशक हम इसी तरह बदला देते हैं नेकोकारों को बेशक ये तो एक खुल्लम खुल्ला आजमाइश थी और हमने फिदे में दे दिया उसको एक बड़ा जबिया और हमने छोड़ दिया उस पर जिक्र खैर आने वाले लोगों में या बाद वाले लोगों में सलाम हो इब्राहिम अलैहिस्सलाम पर इसी तरह हम बदला दिया करते हैं नेकोकारों को बेशक वो हमारे मोमिन बंदों में से था नॉट एन ऑर्डनरी ट्रायल आदमी अपनी जान दे देगा लेकिन अपनी औलाद को धक्का देने धक्का लगने नहीं देगा कोई बाप अपने औलाद को धक्का लगने नहीं देगा वो तमाम परेशानियां तकालीफ खुद बर्दाश्त करने को तैयार हो जाएगा लेकिन बच्चों को जरा भी धक्का ना लगे ये हर कोई वालदे या माँ बाप का जो है या खासतौर पर बाप का जो है ये तरीका होता है और इब्राहिम इस्लाम भी जो है एक बाप की हैसियत से जानते थे कि वो कितने दुआओं के बाद मन्नतों के बाद अल्लाह सुबहाना तला ने एक अजीम शान लड़के से उनको नवाजा था आफ्टर इयर्स एंड इयर्स एंड इयर्स ऑफ सप्लिकेशन ऑलमोस्ट वर्ड्स द फैग एंड ऑफ हिज लाइफ अल्लाह सुबहाना तला बेस्टोड टू हिम सन दैट इज इब्राहिम अलैहिस्सलाम इमेजिन हाउ मच इब्राहिम अलैहिस्सलाम वुड वुड हैव लव्ड हिज 
little son Ismail alayhi salam. But when it came to fulfilling the command of Allah, nothing came his way. Koi jizun ko roki nahi. Allah ke hukum ki tamil mein wo apni zati mohabbat apne jazbat apni khayishat sab ko nazar andaz kar diya unimaginable unbelievable and mind boggling that how could ibrahim al islam ever go ahead with fulfilling the commandment of allah and overcame or set aside all those emotions all that desire and love which he cherished in his heart for his son and went ahead in fulfilling the command of allah mind boggling no wonder allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says inni jailuka lin nasi imama Well, I'm going to make you for the entire mankind a leader. You will be a role model for the entire humanity. I will make you a leader for the entire humanity. I will make you a leader for the entire humanity. I will make you a leader for the entire humanity. I will make you a leader for the entire humanity. I will make you a leader for the entire humanity. I will make you a leader for the entire humanity. I will make you a leader for the entire humanity. I will make you a leader for the entire humanity. I will make you a leader تاریخ میں دیکھی جائے تو یہ ہے اللہ کے رسول نبی کریم صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم سب چیز قربان کر دیا اللہ کی خاطر اینڈ دس از دا وے ایوری بلیور شوڈ ایم ایلٹ ہر مومن کے لیے جو ایک اسوا ہے کاش ہم اس ابراہیم علیہ السلام کے اسوے کو اور رسول اکرم صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم کے اسوے کو ہم اپنا سکتے ہیں دس از ناٹ جسٹ اے نیریٹو بٹ ویری پاورفل میسج وی ڈیرائیو آؤٹ آف دس نیریٹو اینڈ دیٹ از ٹو پلیز اللہ اینڈ ٹو فلفل دا کمانڈ آف اللہ نو بڈی شوڈ کم ان آر وے Allah holds top priority for us in all matters. And if we do this, Allah will grant us that leadership which he has promised. Because when Ibrahim Islam asked, Khala wa min zurriyati, what about my offspring, O Allah? Will you also make, give them the leadership? What did, and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, La yanalu ahadis zalimi. No, my promise <clears throat> will not be for those people who are unfair to allah who are unjust and who commit shirk no if they follow your way and emulate your practices yes then i will grant them leadership wa bashshirnahum bi ishaq nabiyyan min as-salihin wa barakna alayhi wa ala ishaq wa min zurriyati ma muhsinu wa zalimu li nafsihi mubin and we gave him glad tidings of ishaq al islam a prophet among the righteous and we blessed upon him and upon ishaq al islam and from their offspring some who was a good doer and some who wronged himself clearly aur humne usko khushkhabri di ishaq ki ایک نبی صالحین میں سے اور ہم نے برکتیں اتاری اس پر اور اسحاق علیہ السلام پر اور ان کی اولاد میں سے کچھ جو نیکوکار تھے اور کچھ ظلم کیا اپنے جانوں پر کھلم کھلا ولخت مننا اللہ موسا و ہارون و نج ناہما و خوم ہوما نل کرب العظیم و نصر ناہم فقان ہم الغالبین وآتے نہ ہم الکتاب المستبین و ہدے نہ ہم السرات المستقیم و ترکنا علیہما فی الآخرین سلام علی موسا و ہارون انہا کذالک نزل محسنین انہما من عبادن المؤمنین And certainly we conferred a favor upon Musa alayhi salam and Harun alayhi salam 
and we have saved both of them and their people from the distress great and we helped them then they became victors and we gave them a book clear that is Torah and we guided both of them to the straight path and we left upon them in bracket a good name among the later generations Peace be upon Musa al -Islam and Harun al -Islam. Verily, thus we recompense the good to us. Verily, they were both among our slaves believing. And we have done this with Musa al -Islam and Harun al -Islam. And we have saved them and their people from a big problem. And we have helped them and then they are going to be able to get the money. And we have given them ایک واضح کتاب اور ہم نے رہنمائی کی ان دونوں کو سیدھے راستے کی اور ہم نے چھوڑا ان دونوں کے لیے ایک ذکر خیر بعد والی نسلوں میں سلام ہو موسیٰ علیہ السلام اور حارون علیہ السلام پر بے شک اسی طرح ہم بدلہ دیتے ہیں نیکو کاروں کو بے شک وہ دونوں ہمارے مومن بندوں میں سے تھے وَإِنَّا إِلْيَاسَ لَمِنَ الْمُرْسَلِينَ اس قولہ لکھو مہی اللہ تتخون اتد اونا بالوں و تذرون احسن القالقین اللہ ربکم و رب آبائکم الاولین فقض زبوہ فانہم لمحضرون اللہ عباد اللہ المخلصین و ترکنا لہی فی الاخرین سلام علی الیاسین انہ کذالک نجزل محسنین انہو من عبادن المومنین And verily, Ilyas a.s. surely was among the messengers when he said to his people, Allah Tattakun, will not you fear? Do you invoke Baal and you leave the best of the creators, that is Allah, your Lord, and the Lord of your forefathers, former? But they denied him, then verily, they surely will be brought forth, and be brought forth for punishment. Except the slaves, slaves of Allah chosen. And we left upon him any good name among the later generations. Peace be upon Ilyas alayhi salam. Verily, thus we recompense the good words. Verily, he was among our slaves, believing. Or Beshak Ilyas alayhi salam zarur rasulo me se the. Jab unsne kaha apni khom se kya nahi tum takwa ekhtiar karoge? Kya tum pukarte ho baal ko aur chhod dete ho sabse betin peda karne wale ko, yani Allah ko. جو تمہارا رب ہے اور رب تمہارے پہلے والے باپ داداؤں کا بھی لیکن انہوں نے جھٹلایا اس کو پھر بے شک وہ ضرور پیش کیے جائیں گے یعنی عذاب کے لئے پیش کیے جائیں گے سوائے اللہ کے وہ بندے جو چنے ہوئے اور ہم نے چھوڑ دیا اس پر ذکر خیر بعد والے بعد آنے والے لوگوں میں سلام ہو علیہ علیہ السلام پر بے شک ہم اسی طرح بدلہ دیتے ہیں نیکو کاروں کو بے شک وہ ہمارے مومن بندوں میں سے تھا وَإِنَّا لُوتَ لَمِنَ الْمُرْسَلِينَ اِذْ نَجَّيْنَاهُ وَأَهْلَهُ عَجْمَئِنَ إِلَّا عَجُوزًا فِي الْغَابِرِينَ سُمَّ دَمَّرْنَا الْآخَرِينَ وَإِنَّكُمْ لَتَمُرُّونَ عَلَيْهِمْ مُسْبِحِنَا وَبِاللَّيْلِ أَفَلَا تَعْقِلُونَ And verily, Lut alayhi salam surely was among the messengers. When we saved him and his family all, except an old woman among those who lagged behind, then we destroyed the rest. And verily, you surely pass by over them in the morning and by night. Do then not you use your intellect? Or be shak Lut al-Islam zarur rasulo me se thi. Jab ham ne najat di usko aur uske logon ko sab ke sab siwaye ek budiya ki jo piche reh jane walo me se thi. Phir ham ne hilak kar diya dousroon ko, jo barbaat kar diya dousroon ko. Or be shak tum آتے جاتے ہو ان پر صبح اور رات کو پھر کیا نہیں تم آخر کو استعمال کرو گے that means you will not use your intellect and draw lessons out of these destructions which Allah brought upon the people of Luth al-Islam for them having committed sodomy or homosexuality so Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has been mentioning prophet after prophet continuously and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is sharing information about these prophets who are the most honorable servants of Allah who put in their best efforts to convey the message of Islam before the people. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has given this excellent label of khair ummah even to us. 
because after the beloved prophet sallallahu alaihi wasam there is going to be no prophet going to come into this world rasul akram sallallahu alaihi wasam ke duniya se rukhsat ho jane ke baad ab koi nabi aane wala nahi to allah ne kya kiya kuch logon ko allah ne muntakhab kiya jin ka naam musalman rakha aur phir unko jo hai khair e ummat ka laqab bhi diya anas keh raha hu what are we supposed to do we are supposed to follow the legacy of these prophets and convey the message of islam particularly the quran and the authentic teachings of the prophet before the world and we ourselves should be first and foremost in practicing them and give the top priority to allah and his messenger in all matters my wife says like this my father says like this my sister wants like this my children want like this my husband want like this doesn't work of course as far as women are concerned i'm not going to comment on them but as far as men folk are concerned nobody except allah and his messenger for as far as the women are concerned their husbands hold close to hold priority of course as long as they don't contradict anything against islam so allah subhanahu wa taala says that all these narratives which i am mentioning to you is not just for the sake of being mentioned but draw lessons out of these emulate the excellent characters of the prophets for all these prophets put in their utmost to fulfill the commandments of allah and to spread the message of islam and this is what allah subhanahu wa taala wants us as a um, as a ummah e muslima whom allah has given the label of qare ummah to do this excellent work of conveying the message of islam for the people and how could we ever convey it without being empowered with the knowledge of islam so as we learn islam and as we learn the quran and the teachings of the prophet we need to share it with others for allah's prophet said balligu anni wano aya convey the message even if you know one verse ek ayat bhi agar tumhe malum hai to logon ko pahuncha do this is a responsibility which lies on our weak shoulders may allah help us to execute it to the best of our ability and may allah subhanahu wa taala facilitate for us amen ya rabbal alamin inshallah tomorrow we will complete allah willing surah safat and as time permits we will proceed with another surah surah swad looking forward to seeing you tomorrow inshallah same time jazakallahu khair wa aqul dawa na alhamdulillah rabbil alamin subhanallahi wa bihamdi subhanakallahu wa bihamdika نشهد ان لا اله الا انت نستغفرك ونتوب اليك السلام عليكم ورحمه الله وبركاته